on the Miguel and Holly and the Hits 961 Facebook page for Queen City Confessions. All your anonymous secrets. Here's the first one. I had one of those edible drinks. Okay. So if you don't know, this is Miguel speaking, not the confession. Uh, okay. These are drinks that can have CBD or THC in them. So it's like taking an edible or something right. like that. But it's a beverage. Guys. Right. So back, <laughs> back to the confession. The confession. <laughs> I had one of those edible drinks. I don't even know what it is, but another one of my mom friends gave it to me before we went into parent teacher meetings. Best decision I've ever made. Wow. I've never been that relaxed talking to my kid's teacher who I strongly dislike. Oh. Well, okay. Just be careful. Yeah. Just be careful of those things because you don't know how it's going to react. Right. How powerful they could be. So just be careful. And yeah, it's your, it's a little bit of a, a dice roll, but um, I'm glad for you. Here's another confession. I ran into a coworker while out this weekend. I don't really know him that well. We hooked up in the bathroom at a Chili's. What? Wait. <laughs> I found him on Instagram this weekend and found out that he's married with two kids. Oh, not at the Chili's. I've been trying to avoid him in the office, and now I feel horrible. Well, girl, that's not your fault. You didn't know no, that. No. You didn't know that. Obviously not. You didn't know that. Maybe we th rethink hooking up with near strangers in the chili bathroom. <laughs> just as a, as a, yeah, well, just as a word of a general, but it's too late. So, right. um, but that's not your fault. I guess you're left with like, do you do anything with this information? I think you just have to shut it down. You just have to be done. And if he tries to be like, hey, let's go for round two, but let's try Applebee's this time. Oh you say God. no. Um, but I am curious. Have you ever hooked up with someone and then found out they were married? It happens more than you think. Right? What did you do? Did you distance yourself? Did you tell that person's spouse? 1-844-HITS-961. 1-844-448-7961. Or text uh, us. You can put the word HITS with your message and send it to 96893. Here's the final confession. My husband and I haven't had adult time for a year and a half. Oh. I don't even know how to approach it. You got to have a conversation. Well, yeah. You got to have an honest what do you conversation. Mean you don't know how to approach it. You tell your partner, hey, we have to talk about our intimacy itch issue. When, when, when is the best time to do that? And right. then you simply are honest and say, listen, we haven't been intimate in a year and a half. Is What's going on in your brain? Because obviously... That's not, um, I don't know if I want to say normal, but it's it's certainly not uh, advisable, it's abnormal. I guess. Yes. Yeah. Um, so that's, you have to just do it. Have you ever been in that situation where you've, or what's the longest you've gone without being with your partner if you were together? Text hits in your message to 96893. All right, it is 730. We got to get to blown off. Now, Jenny and Darren went to painting with a twist for their first date. Jenny like could not stop talking about how much of a great time she had. Well, Darren was not happy with something Jenny did at painting with the twist. Right. 